So my name is Stefan Meyer from Germany. I'm working for the University of Göttingen and I'm a specialist in agrobiodiversity, especially in the biodiversity of plants which are growing on arable land. One of the main tasks of the Terra Lemnia project is to looking how different kind of management uh, regimes are affecting the biodiversity. And so I'm responsible for this plan, uh, for this part, especially uh, to do the investigations with the white arable plants. A lot of farmers are trying to identi uh, intensify their work. So they are using, for example, uh, herbicides and of course herbicides and pesticides are affecting biodiversity yeah? and we are looking yeah, to, to see how much on what level they are affecting this yeah? and that's a quite, uh, quite important and interesting thing. Another thing is uh, if the farmers are uh, using um, the seeds from the years before yeah, for again seeing uh, the, the, soil, the soil it again and uh, you can see some special patterns because some of our plants are uh, what should I say? They really need that they are cutted with the with the uh, with the corn, and to see again in the next years. Yeah. So uh, third visit here on Limnus. So the last one was in uh, in January for the uh, yeah startup meeting, and I've been here uh, three years ago. Lemnos was in uh, former times also really important for producing uh, wheat and corn and cereals for Athena, for example. Yeah. So that makes the island a little bit special because nearly half of the island is covered by arable land. Yeah, yeah. And comparing to other uh, Aegean islands, it's it's yeah, it's it's not the case like this. Yeah. So that's that's the speciality of of, of Lemnos. Yeah. Because they are producing so or they are using so much of the land cover for arable farming.